ton of hype on the 67 pick davis mills and i discuss a little bit more about it next cue the intro what is going on everybody welcome back to a brand new episode of the league your host as always harley dugan wanted to talk about davis mills and pep hamilton there's a lot of hype around Texan fans over a 67th overall pick. There's nothing wrong with that. I'm going to start this video off with a bang. We need to slow down on the Davis Mills hype. Let's slow it down a bit, and let's slow down on the Pep Hamilton Hall of Fame hype too, okay? Both of these guys, Pep Hamilton was with the D.C. Defenders at one time. You don't know who the D.C. Defender is? Go look it up. This guy, for some reason, people feel like we can have any quarterback in the world, but as long as we got Pep Hamilton, we're going to be all right. Let's calm down. Look, I respect Pat Pallington. I think he do a very solid job with Davis Mills, who people want to compare to as if you squint your eyes, he's like Andrew Luck. No, 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 no. We're not doing that. We are not doing that. We're not comparing the 67th overall pick to a guy that was the number one overall pick uh, once in a generation quarterback in Andrew Luck. We're not doing that, okay? We're not going to be doing that. We're not taking it to that step. But I will say this. I am pleased looking at Davis Mills. I am looking at what he's done with the football. And yes, the risk versus reward factor plays here at 67. Davis Mills had some serious knee injuries in high school. He only played 11 games in Stanford. But if he stays, then he would have been a first round pick next year, right? That's pretty much the general consensus. Even John Harris, if nobody knows who John Harris is, Greg Follow, really good guy on everything, scouting, college prospects, and NFL. He even said to himself, if he stays another year, he is a first-round pick, like guaranteed. So risk versus reward. Overall, I think the Texans did a solid job at 67. They're grabbing a guy that has a ton of potential and could potentially be the next quarterback for the Houston Tech. So that's it for today's video, guys. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell for the notice to turn on. Drop your comments, your reactions down below in the comment section. Let me know what do you think about the 67 pick of Davis Mills. And I want to know what y'all think about Pep Hamilton as a QB's coach. Lots of hype around him. I think it needs to slow down just a bit. The guy isn't the Band-Aid for every single problem that the Texans will have. As always, guys, go Astros, go Rockets, go Texans. Y'all have a blessed day.